Mark Gaffer, your initial thoughts? Um, disappointing, um, gutted, angry, um, a bit mixed at the moment. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't think I could express my thoughts without swearing. Um, it felt like a game we had chances in, they maybe had more of the ball than us, but felt almost like we had them at arms bay and then and then we almost gifted them two goals. Um, I'd say the possession was probably even, I thought we controlled the vast majority of the first half. Um, we wasn't ruthless enough in front of goal, we, we've had five, six, seven really good chances today and we've come away with one goal. Um, you know, it's something we need to address, we're not scoring enough goals. Um, it's um, it's disappointing. Do the boys want to have that desire to, to go and score goal after goal? Um, I hope so, but I'm not sure. Um, it's it's disappointing. You know, they they haven't had too many chances themselves. I think they had one chance before they scored, half a chance. I think um, one long ball. We're not we're not switched on, and and they've gone in, and scored, and we've given another team a leg up, and and they've capitalised on it. Um, to be fair, things were looking good at half time. I thought it was, it was a well won ball by Amadou down the, down the flank, and then and he set up for Dan, who he's finished well. Yeah, it was a good, it was a good goal. It was that desire, you know, to, to go and close and win the ball back from Amadou, which he gives us. Um, good finish from from Smithy as well, which puts us one up. We should be comfortable. We've got enough experience in that change room to go and see that game out. Um, well, where, where do we go from here? No, no game midweek now, so. No, look, it's not, it's not the end of the world, you know, we've got a good group in there. Um, a couple of things have happened today and they've, they've got their goals, they've taken their chances. Um, and, and sometimes you've got to suffer a bit of pain in football to come out the other side. So um, there's things that I need to kind of address as well. And as, as staff, we, we need to make sure that we've got the players in that are going to kind of do what we want them to do, which is put the point in the back of the net and, and keep clean sheets. And we're not really doing both at the moment, which is disappointing. Um, we're controlling games, yes. Um, we're looking threatening, yes. Um, but we're not putting the ball in the net enough. Yeah, um, we, we had the boys in for training during the week and then and then look towards Ascot. Yeah, we'll, we'll train Tuesday, Thursday. We'll, we'll be back in. Um, there won't be any days off. And we're, we're, we've got a good enough group in there that once we go, I think we'll we'll put a good run together. It's just just getting everyone on the right page and then going to get a, get a couple of results on the spin and then we'll be right. And credit to the fans that have travelled down here today. I mean, I, I know they've got them disappointed, but they were, their, their journey wasn't easy. <laughs> I know we, we've had, yeah. had train troubles and stuff and, and credit to them for, for their support. Yeah, they were superb again. They, they get behind the boys and, and the boys owe them something, you know, to, to come down here three, three and a half hours, whatever it is. and and go and throw the game away like we have, it's, it's disappointing and full credit to them, I thank them, I hope that the, the boys do and we'll look to see if we can do something for the people that visit here. Cheers boss. Cheers mate.